Yeah, when it comes to details and what people think of me when considering details, um, I'm, I think people think I'm pretty particular. Um, I like what I like, but I'm also open to new things and new ideas and new technologies. Uh, but I'm I'm really focused on the small details, um, especially when it comes to lenses, for instance, uh, and uh, the vision and stuff that I need to need to see clear um, and also really particular, especially with the lenses that I don't like scratches and stuff. So I, I, uh, I'm pretty particular with the details. And I think a lot of people, especially that knows me as well, knows that, yeah, uh, with skiing, I can feel everything about the skis, the equipment, if I don't, feel good I'm gonna tell them that I don't feel good but also if I feel like something is really good I'm also gonna tell them that I feel like this is really good uh, so I think I'm pretty straight arrow um, pretty straightforward and I always tell the truth I definitely feel the difference between the rig technology and the normal lens uh, that's for sure uh, we've also been playing a playing around a lot with the different kind of rig lenses. Um, because for for people who are out skiing on a beautiful winter day when it's sunny and blue skies, uh, you want the eyes to relax as well as have good contrasts and a good vision. Um, but sometimes as alpine skier that skis between 50 seconds and 1 minute 20 seconds sometimes you want the ice to not I, I wouldn't say to be more on but you don't think that much about the ice relaxing that much uh, so when when I go skiing with the family or when I'm training and it's super sunny and I'm out training for three, four hours skiing, I need a lens that makes the ice relax as well. But for instance, if it's a little dark or cloudy or foggy, I need a lens that's gonna help me the 50 to one minute, 20 seconds that I'm on the course. Um, and I think especially working together with Stolle uh, on this technology and we, we tried a lot of different things. Uh, I think we kind of found a lot from best of both worlds within the rig technology um, and, and for me that was a huge thing to both have the possibility to have the ice not get tired over a training period that's three to four hours but also have the possibility to have the lenses that are gonna make it like super intense for that 50 to 1 minute 20 seconds um, that's, that's pretty cool when you can have such a close relationship and work with this type of technology.